you received an owl post. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the lock that we found at Gringotts. <laughs> POV, your mom tells you how to dress yourself. Map of Orgly Shire. This map depicts or Orgly Shire, a region in Scotland which contains the Hebrides, native home from Herodian Black Dragon. Oh, there's a chest here. Completely missed it. I think I know too much of Hogwarts. That's why I need you, Slatan. I forgot most of the things in Hogwarts. Revenge. Why? Uh, why were we sitting on the ground? Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin, you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to? They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. They want his ability, I guess. Since he can see and use ancient, mag uh, ancient magic. Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise. And a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Can you change the story by using different dialogues? I don't think so. I think the only thing that changes are your side quests. From what I heard, but yeah. Revelio. Uh, heard you're defending Hogsmeade against trolls. You know what that means. Can jump down here. Nope. I 
happened here? Or also not? Might some kind soul help me? Are you all right? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Wow. <laughs> okay. Everyone hates you. Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst. That no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Gobstones? Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Ever written a story or a terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. Hmm, what could that be? Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got up there somehow. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Wow, that sounds so depressing, man. Is there fall damage in this game? I hope not. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Oh, there's another the quest. Dalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Hello, Nelly. You seem excited oh, it's about Nelly. something. The Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumor is that a former headmistress, Professor Moll, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Surely you will be trying to complete the challenge as well? Ah, uh, I've tried, and I can't even get past the first cabinets. Perhaps you'll have better luck. I'd love to know what's in the cabinets. Do we get some spells from them? Why would Professor Mole conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or may not be true. He's a poltergeist. I thought they could go almost anywhere. Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. The astronomy I tower. I was keys, there least. before. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find. If anything. I need to comp complete Professor Hackett's assignment before I can continue with this quest. You must learn the fire making charm to continue the story. Hmm. Okay. As a Dalian key, I wonder where it might lead me. Uh. 
Oh, it's here. There's the cabinet. How do I get this key in there? Wow. Why well, I have to wait till... Damn it. <laughs> That's it. An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. So many collectibles. I guess we will play this game for a long time. <laughs> Were you able to follow one of the Dedalian keys? Hello, Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like a Gryffindor house token. I'd better unlock our house chest. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in our common room and heard there are also in the other common rooms. Keep an eye out. I do hope you continue on. For so much effort, the prize must be something grand. I should see this through and find the Gryffindor house chest. Or those house chests, those chests with those eyes? Or is, is that something else? Okay, it's that other chest, the golden one. This must be my. Seems I'll need to find more house tokens if I'm to open this. Quite a few, by the look of it. Sixteen. Holy shit. Thirty to forty hours, apparently. Okay. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Accio. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. I think it, uh, it sh should be just the main story because there are a lot of collectibles here. Rebellion. Oh, there's another um, key. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. And there is it. Accio. If you do practically everything, there are um, hundred hours are possible, or is possible. Interesting. Revelio. Palmer's remodel. This the standing model of a hand is demarcated to help students in the practice of palmistry. Depending on the the angle at which this model is read, it either has the core 
considerable lifeline for it or is likely to die in a fortnight okay another chest Motiva Onai, under Professor Black's direction, it is my honor as deputy mistress to offer you the position of divination professor at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. You are thrilled at the prospect of having you join our distinguished faculty. Please inform us of your intentions as soon as possible. I eagerly await your response. Warmest regards, Professor Matilda Weasley. Oh, um. Akio. That was a good spot. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Akio. Nice. Um Revelio. Levioso. Oh, whoa. No, uh, page. Accio. No, where was he aiming at? Where's that page? No, damn it. Roll button. Got it. Revelio. Oh, there's another key. I keep Akio. Pr pressing the wrong button. I I hope it stays there. It's all the way up there. There's so much detail to this place, and I ha I haven't even seen everything of it. The the level of detail is impressive. How do I get up there? Handy resource indeed. Oh here. Revelio. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. <laughs> Goblet of Fire Casket. The Goblet of Fire rests within the, this ancient jewel and cross the chest. The goblet has served as a means of selecting champions for the tri wi I can't read. Tri wizard tournament since the contest established in the late 13th century. So where's the thing? Isn't it up there? Revelio. Thro uh, trophy room. This room contains the house cup, Quidditch trophies, dueling trophies, and other awards given at the school. Students who step out of line can be found polishing the silver here by hand as a reminder of value, of the value of hard work. Hogwarts Herbology Award. 
the recognition of exemplary skill in the field of her herbology, Hogwarts bestows this special award upon seven year Hufflepuff Mirable Garlic. From Mandrax to Mistletoe and Bogota Tubbers to Bouncing Bulbs. Her birth with Flora has exceeded all expectations. <laughs>